Hello everyone, I, my name is Nitsan and I'm a diet and lifestyle coach and I would like to um, share my idea about, I didn't do any research but I'll do a video about protein because I feel like just for myself it's, I need to talk about it. So protein, so many people has this belief that protein is giving us energy, is giving us building our body, building our brain. I don't know what you know what protein is even. I know that from what I heard that we have amino acids that our body takes and creates protein from that. And we have the, I don't know, 20 something amino acids that we get, and then there is the amino acid that nobody creates. And I know from many researchers that I've seen that tells that we can get it from plants. And from my experience, over six years of eating high carb diet, most of the time i feel i never felt anything like that like lack of protein and it's just the belief that a lot of people has been getting from media from their parents their grandparents their stories their books their whatever and now i'm asking who is telling us those stories who is telling us those researchers? Who is talking to us? Who is talking talking through us and through uh, through those people? Because when I see someone coming to me and asking me, "But Nitsan, where 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 do I get my proteins?" I see the disbelief in themselves, the lack of knowledge of how they their own body will, and they and those people they have to go and find a, a, another truth because they don't know themselves. They don't know how their body works. So they have to get an approval of, okay, I'm getting enough on this, on that, on that. And that's what I see in people when they ask me where I get my protein. It's just ignorance and lack of knowledge of how the body works. And I'm sorry if anyone is offended by this video. I'm just saying my true honest opinion. And then my feeling is I get all my proteins from plants and vegetables. I'm, I'm feeling that. If I want to get more, I eat more plants. I eat more vegetables. If I want to gain muscle, I train. I train. I don't train. Yeah, I train my abs a little bit so I can walk on my back and my abs and my uh, knees issues and other things. But I don't train my muscles, I don't train my chest, I don't train my, uh, my other muscles. It's just, I don't see a reason to because I like my body physique. And I don't see a reason to change anything. But a lot of people do see a reason to. And to change that, you have to train hard. While training hard, you're gonna gain muscle because the body is gonna use those amino acids to rebuild those muscles. And that's how the body functions. The body creates uh, and build uh, proteins within itself. And it doesn't need you to take care of it. You just need to train. And then when you're training, you're spending energy and that energy can be used to um, this energy can be used to train and re regenerate the body in the right way and if you feed your body the right food it's gonna gain weight the right way if you're gonna g give it the wrong food it's not gonna gain weight the same way and a lot of it is gonna be fat because usually when you eat normal cooked food it's coming with a lot of fat and salt and then it holds in the body and toxins and it stays there and then you 
gain fat, you don't gain muscle. Uh, so protein is nice, but it's not something I ever focus on in the last six years as a vegan. And it's the cause of a lot of issues that we have. We are not meant to process cooked proteins and, and it just it destroys our, our gut and you can gain more weight eating more protein but you're also damaging your body. You're damaging your body because you're feeding yourself the wrong information and you're basically abusing your system and you're getting older and sicker faster. So I don't see a reason to cook our proteins and do anything about cooking food and changing any any diet that we already are used to because we are not involved into it we are still in this time frame where we are not involved into eating cooked food yet and maybe in the future we will involve to eat cooked food but I don't see this turn of humankind go into this better direction by doing this I just see the fall of mankind by doing this so um, I don't see protein or cooked protein any better than eating vegetables or fruit because the body is not gonna observe it as well when you eat nothing but juices your body just observe and when you eat just cooked food the body works so hard to process it and takes a lot of energy from the body to process it and it's just not effective and not good for the body and thank you everyone for listening for this video hope you're having a great morning good great day and and see you on the next video